What's up friends? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Elizabeth. This is EJ Joyful Plans and I have all kinds of new or new-ish products to share with you today. I'm doing it all in one video just so I can get this out quickly to you guys in case you're interested in purchasing. So uh, I've got some JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop, Amber Plans Her Day, and Plan Anything. I wanted to get Plan Anything out to you guys quickly because um, she's taking orders until I think November 17th. Uh, then she's moving across the country, so she's kind of pausing on um, shipping. So if you guys are interested in what's in this box, you're going to want to place it in the next couple of weeks from uh, the time that this video is posting. So let's let's start with, well, let's get everything out of the packaging. How about that? So I'm going to move this stuff out of the way. So this is Planny Thing. I will link down below her shop and I am an affiliate meaning if you do decide to pick something up I would love if you used my affiliate link it doesn't cost you anything it's just a route to her website that logs oh I you know I'm purchasing this because I heard about it from Elizabeth and I get um, a small commission from your purchase so I really appreciate when y'all use affiliate links a lot of people have affiliate links and it really is a simple way um, just to encourage uh, content creators and you know allows us to continue doing our thing um, so I appreciate you guys so much using my affiliate links when they are an option so again this is from Planny Thing. so we have our thank you card and then this release has two things in it one is a re-release of her houses and trees volume one sticker book and then the other item is the All You Need Is Love sticker book. And I already have a flip through on my channel because I originally bought this when it came out, the Houses and Trees sticker book. So I am, I'll just leave this in the packaging and I will link down below. Let me show you my original Houses and Trees just to see. I don't think there's gonna be anything different about it. Here you can see, here's my original Houses and Trees. And yeah, it's identical. So she's re-releasing this. I have a flip through of this on my channel if you're interested in it. The Houses and Trees collections that she's done are excellent sticker books for scrapbooking, for planning, any type of journaling. They're just great staples because it's literally all different seasons, all different styles of houses and trees. And so you can kind of create your own scene in your planner, in your scrapbook, in your journal, and they're just excellent. So I have a flip through of this on my channel already, so I'm not going to do that again. But again, I will link the houses and trees sticker book down below. I also have a video of a flip through of the houses and trees part two. I will link that down below as well so you can see the differences. Let's say you missed the Houses and Trees original and you picked up part two. Well, uh, I've got this flipped through along with kind of a comparison with the original. So if you have this one, I do think it's still good to have the OG part one because they are different enough in my opinion. So those will be linked down below. So re-release of Houses and Trees. Yay, very excited for that, especially for those of you who wanted it and missed out the first time. So the second item, new item, is the All You Need Is Love. I have not seen a flip through of this um, just because I haven't been on social media because I just had my daughter three weeks ago. She's three weeks today, you guys. I cannot believe it, time is moving so quickly. Um, so I have not seen a flip through, we're gonna do that together. Actually, I'm gonna set this side. Should I, well, let's just do this right now. So this is the Planny Thing All You Need Is Love sticker book. And, oh, it's just already so cute. So we've seen kind of, or we're seeing a merging of um, the houses and trees with this kind of, I guess you could say Valentine's Day theme. So it is a little bit early, but her stuff sells out quickly. So if this is something you'll be interested in in January and February, I would definitely order it now. But this is a clear sheet of trees and houses. And I just love the little banners and the hearts um, strung up in the trees. So we're gonna have two sheets of those. And these are clear. So these are gonna look so good. Um, like if you make your own cards for Valentine's Day. Um, where are my tweezers? I'm always looking for my tweezers. Hold on. Here we go. Um, 
but yeah, I just love the clear stickers because you can make your own, make your own things with these like Valentine's, Valentine's Day cards. So here's the next sheet, also clear. We've got cupcakes and cakes and sweet treat drinks, a mailbox with Valentine's, and then these cute little like Valentine's Day stands with treats. And that's clear, these are all clear. I like the colors, they're very like vintage, vintage colored. Now we've got more sweet treats, cakes and strawberries, cupcakes, Maybe jelly beans in there. Would you say those are jelly beans? I think those are jelly beans. That guy right there. Delicious, not nutritious. Definitely what I've been craving these days. Oh, this is lovely. Okay, so here we have flowers. And the, actually it looks like mine. No, they're not flowers. Wait, hold on. This might be, I think this is a misprint. This is a misprint, hold on because we have the, um, usually we have two sheets of these and it looks like based on these guys, this is a misprint. So I can tell here, I'll have to let her know, mine, mine is a misprint, but so this is like the glass here, but it has flowers on it. So I'll have to let her know that mine has a misprint on it. Although that's kind of cool. <laughs> so then we, so that should have been two sheets of this guy. Then we have our coordinating boxes, which y'all know I love there when there's not a lot of decor in the boxes, because if I'm putting so much decor on my planner or in my journal, um, the boxes, it's nice to have neutral. So they don't kind of compete with the decorative elements that I'm laying down myself. So here are your corresponding boxes. Okay, beautiful florals. I love this color, the kind of eucalypt eucalyptusy color, and this doesn't have to be for Valentine's Day. To me, this actually screams wedding, very similar to the wedding colors I had in my wedding, and I think these are lovely. And I love that she does the individual elements, the small ones, so you can create your own bouquet. Love that. Same colors, these are a little bit more full, full finished bouquets. We've got some flat edge ones down here. These are great for kind of bracketing in boxes. You've got your top and your bottom. Two sheets of these. And we're all, other than the boxes, these are clear matte stickers. Then we have our corresponding boxes with those florals. So you can see how well those match. Lovely. This is gorgeous. If anybody's got a wedding coming up or going to a wedding, like this to me is very, very bridal. Then we have more traditional Valentine's Day. I love the banners, little teddy bear. These are clear. Mm. Seeing all this sweet stuff makes me want sweet stuff. More love. I love the ones down here with the boxes, the little like cubed little boxes. And the bicycle. It's love o'clock. Look, these, this says love, like every, oh my gosh, I can't talk. The uh, numbers are all letters for love. And you get two sheets of these. And then here are your corresponding boxes that match, match that design set. All right, so here are the florals that we saw printed in that previous page. These are lovely, love that they're individual again so that I can make my own clusters. And I love this more like vintagey color. These kind of like dirtier rose colors, love those. And even the red is more of like a cranberry, um, a winter red, which is nice. So you can use these all winter long. You don't have to use them just in February. It doesn't have to be a Valentine's Day um, book. This is definitely a winter, winter reds book, I'd say. Very pretty. Ooh, this is pretty. I love this colorway. It's much more vintage, 
more of those kind of dirty mauve rosy tones. And I love boxes like this. So these have the cutout in the center so that you can actually write um, inside there. I love that. Love those alternative like frames. They're so pretty. We get two pages of those. And then love the color scheme. So these boxes then go with this collection of florals. So pretty. We get two sheets of those. Then we have a page of hearts, all different types of hearts. Again, all of these are on clear mat. We get two sheets of those. And then these are paper. Oh, this is fun. And we get two sheets of these. These are paper. So these you actually would use like a colorful box. Excellent. And we have two different sizes of those on two. We got two sheets of those. So that is All You Need Is Love. The All You Need Is Love sticker book is available now and it is linked down below. Let's see what we have from Amber Plans Her Day. Um, let me cut these open. Actually, of course, where can I find my scissors? Where are my scissors? Uh, hold on a second, friends. I am all over the place. I used to have scissors hanging right above me and now they're gone. So we're gonna have to use these little baby ones. So let's see what we have from Amber Plans Her Day. I have two sticker books. One of these has been out for a hot minute. Black Quotes Volume 2. Um, this was released, I want to say last month, but it is still available. So I'm still going to show it to you in case you missed it, in case it's new to you. We have Black Quotes Volume 2. And then this was released just a couple of days ago. Um, this is, I believe, the Winter Memories. Yes, Winter Memories. So let's do a little looky-loo at both of these. Both are available in Amber's shop now. And I do have a coupon code for Amber Plans for Day. So Joyful10 will save you 10% off on sticker books at Amber Plants Her Day. So if you are eyeing any of the sticker books or these guys, 10% uh, off with Joyful10, J-O-Y-F-U-L-10. Let's look at the Black Quotes Volume 2. I'm gonna do this a little bit more quickly because y'all probably have seen this. This has been out for a month, but it is still available. If you haven't seen it, it's new to you. But I just love clear black quotes. I just think they are excellent and very easy to add into any planner spread. So volume two, so cool to have. Um, we've got encouraging quotes here. Make today amazing. Don't forget how wildly capable you are. You're doing great. Live more, worry less. I love that she has done a mix of her handwriting, which I think she... I don't know if any of these are her handwriting. Well, she does a mix of her handwriting and then different fonts. And I really, really like that. Um, so maybe strong is hers and then you are isn't. Or maybe maybe she wrote that whole thing. I don't know. Um, but I just love the mix of fonts. And then she's filled in space with different like stickers of texture, which are great to add to any spread. So I love that she's taking advantage of the whole sheet. She's not ripping us off uh, by, you know, really filling things in. So we've got lots to play with here. Um, and then is this the same? Are we getting two sheets? Make today amazing. Be kind to yourself. Yes. So we have two sheets of the same quotes. If you really like one, you don't have to be without it. Uh, after you use it once, no hoarding these stickers. Here we have more encouragement. Your only limit is you. Just breathe, dream big. Uh, again, adding extra flourishes up here, like these stars. So great. I love it. Love these different texts, these different font types. For me, that makes it, I don't want a sticker book that's 100% the same font. So when you change things up like this, it's just fun to play with. So love that. We have two sheets of those. All of these are on clear matte paper. Then we have uh, more encouragement. Go for it. Make today count. Prove yourself. 
Prove to yourself, not others, you are incredible. Never fail until you stop trying. Be strong. Wait, never fail until you stop trying. Be stronger than your excuses. Be kind, be brave, be honest. Again, adding more uh, kind of decorative stickers to fill in some space. And I appreciate that. Dreams don't work unless you do. You can. End of story. Growth is growth no matter how small. I am doing this for me. This is an excellent sticker. Be real, not perfect. Also excellent. Life is tough, but so are you. These are great. I would say, I mean, I like the original, but do I have the original nearby? I like the original, but I think I like the second one better. I don't think I have it within reach. Hold on. I'm, I'm reaching over. To see quotes. Is this a quotes? Blind florals. That is not a quotes. Well, maybe at the end of this video, I'll grab it. But um, I like this. I like this a lot. I think she used more fonts this time around uh, than, than the previous. Okay, so we've got be a nice human. Don't forget to smile. Good things take time. Enjoy the day. Stay positive. Your only limit is you. Your potential is endless. Happiness is not a destination, it's a way of life. So yeah, I think when we see more of the cursive, um, more calligraphy type writing, that is Amber's writing, and then she's mixed it up with other fonts. I just think that is so cool looking. I love it. Don't look back, you're not going that way. Be a nice human. Let your kindness change the world. Always be kinder than necessary. So this is all about kindness. Kind vibes only. I get two sheets of those. Kind of moving quickly because I'm presuming a good number of you have already seen this, but you can pause it at any point uh, if you if you want to see these quotes more more detailed. If you're going through hell, keep going. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. Grow positive thoughts. Got that like kind of a hippie vibe on there. If you're broken, you do not have to stay broken. The best way out is always through. This is all about hope and encouragement. You are enough. Not until we are lost, we begin to understand ourselves. These are great quotes. Great quotes. Always be. So this is about creating and crafts, all the things. I'm not messy. I'm creatively organized. Crafting is my therapy. Craft more, worry less. Crafters going to craft, run on coffee and crafting. So this is like our crafting um, sheet. We have two of those. Kind of classy, kind of savage. Okay, so this is a little more sassy, right? Adult-ish. Sorry I'm late. I, I didn't want to come. <laughs> this is this is a good one. Sorry I'm late. I didn't want to come. Probably my favorite sticker so far. I don't have the energy to pretend I like you today. Ooh, busy doing nothing. Another fine day ruined by adulting. Adulthood. I'm sorry, did I roll my eyes out loud? It's a beautiful day to leave me alone. So here's your little sassy quotes. I love that she's included those. Oh, more sassy quotes. Sarcastic comment loading. Please wait. Maybe swearing will help. I speak fluent sarcasm. I'm only sarcastic when I speak. I'm allergic to stupidity. I break it out in sarcasm. Just so we're clear, I, IDK, IDC, oh yeah, and also IDGAF. I'm not going to tell you what that is, but you can Google it. <laughs> uh, if only common sense was more common, suck it up, buttercup. These are great. And she's done a really great job mixing up encouragement, craftiness, sassiness, hopefulness. Uh, I, I think that's really a nice balanced uh, sticker book. What? Okay, the rest of these guys are big quotes. Y'all know I love a big quote. So let's go through these. I'm not gonna read all of them because I'm presuming y'all can see these a little bit more easily because they're big quotes, but check these out. You can, end of story, live your best life. Dream big, enjoy the little things. I can do hard things. Be kind, be brave, be honest, dare to begin. Be kind to your mind, make every day count. Be brave, take risks. Your, fe your feelings are valid. Your only limit is you. Your potential is endless. You are doing great. Live your best life. You got this. 
all the things crafters gonna craft. So these are like the best of quotes, uh, blown up, made nice and big. Crafting makes everything better. Choose kindness, kindness counts. Maybe swearing will help, adult-ish. Another fine day ruined by adulthood, classy, crafty, and hella sassy. And that is the Black Quotes Volume 2. While I'm here, because I'm no one if I am not thorough in my flip throughs, let me find Land Basics Black Quotes. Here we go. Okay, so here is the original Black Quotes. Um, 346, we have 416. And so you can see here, the style's really different because the original Black Quotes is all of... Amber's handwriting. See, it's all her handwriting. And she changes the size a little bit. So you do get a little bit of that style of a quote with kind of a mixed look to it. But that's very different from this where she's actually using a variety of different fonts. And I like a variety of different fonts like these guys. Um, so very different. Um, Different enough to where if you have the original Black Quotes, Black Quotes Volume 2, totally different. Still worth buying this one, even if you have this one, because they're just, they're totally different. Um, and if you don't have this one, I for sure would get this one. If you wanted to pick between the two, if this one's still available. I like Volume 2 better than Volume 1, but that's just me. You can totally see how Amber has like changed her style or is like evolving and I like it. I'm here for it. I'm totally here for it. So Black Quotes Volume 2, I will link that down below. Joyful 10 for 10% 10 off of that sticker book. Let's look at Winter winter Memories. So she also has Winter Collections. I do not have that sticker book. We'll look through the Winter Memories. Um, this one I picked out because it's just more my style. There were a couple sheets. Uh, once we get in here, you'll know, oh, that's for sure, Elizabeth. It's very choose your own adventure um, and very good for kind of setting your own scenes. And I've noticed with her memories books versus her collections books, the memories are more DIY crafty, in my opinion, because of how you can build up stickers and layer stickers together to make your own scenes. Whereas the winter collections are more like finished stickers. So it just depends on, they're, they're both beautiful and they both are, they stand alone on their own, but if you were to pick one, I'd you know pick based on whether or not you want more of a, a custom um, looking spread or journal or scrapbook versus um, more kind of made for you already stickers if that makes sense okay so winter memories this is brand new available now I have seen a flip through and I love it um absolutely love the um the landscape stickers here these are clear matte love this sunset and we've seen some uh wildlife in a happy planner sticker book uh, I think it was the, was it the fall harvest hold on that I actually happen to have Oh, right here. Was it the Fall Harvest sticker book? There was a sticker book I had. Was it this one? That had animals in it. Yes. These animals you could so easily throw onto these landscapes from Amber Plans Her Day. So just an idea if you're looking at this and going, what do I do with a landscape like that? It's just great to put maybe at the top of your planner or maybe at the bottom of a scrapbook page but then you can add elements to it to kind of build it out so first sheet lovely love it so much with the landscapes these are matte clear these are also matte clear these are lovely snowflakes and they're actually blue and gold so if you don't celebrate christmas for example you celebrate hanukkah these colors are hanukkah colors and it's wintry so you could easily kind of incorporate a sheet like this into a Hanukkah-related um, scene or Hanukkah-related um, planning page. This is why I picked out this book. Look at this. Can you see what these are? These are paper stickers. These are shapes of the start of snowmen and like blankets of snow. And that 
is so that you can build your own snowman. These are all individual elements on clear sticker paper. And you would basically just pop them on and make your own snowman. To me, this is so much fun. If you have kids and you want to make a Christmas card for grandma, or as my mom is being called with baby Esther, uh, her name is Bubby. So if uh, we wanted to make a Christmas card for Bubby, you know, you could have your child put together um, a snowman for grandma. I love that. I love that. This I saw this in a uh, reel on uh, Amber's Instagram account, and I was like, yes. Yes, please, I wanna build my own snowman. I love it so much. So now we have, these are clear stickers, snow globes, so pretty. Then we have some sports, winter sports. We've got snowboarding, skiing, inner tubing. These are really fun, really, really fun. So if you are going on a snow trip, this could be a fun page to use in your like memory planner. That's why this is, winter memories. So it's kind of presuming that you might be scrapbooking with a sticker book like this. You don't have to, but you can. Love the gingerbread cookies and houses. These will be so fun to, uh, to do a spread with. Because I like that it's neutral. So if you want to do a Christmas be Christmassy spread, but you don't want it to be all red and green, this would be a really beautiful kind of vintage brown spread. I love those. Then we have more of a traditional like children's Christmas with the wood toys and the stuffed animals. These are really cute. Great for memory keeping. Great for Esther's first Christmas. Oh, so cute. Then we have a sheet of sweaters, ugly sweaters. It's not Christmas without some ugly sweaters. That's just, yeah, too funny. We've got holiday beverages, some like apple cider, hot chocolate. Mm. Every time I see these like wintry foods in sticker books, it makes me want to run downstairs and get something to drink. Ugh, so good. Um, Starbucks has their winter menu up now in case you, in case you're living under a rock, uh, the holidays have arrived. Mm, so good. I love going, it's so satisfying going from these kind of vibrant colors to this. Look at those neutrals. Warm and cozy. I love this colorway. It's so fun. Again, these are clear matte. These have all been clear matte. Now we have more kind of cozy, but in a different colorway with the navies and the greens. Candles, knitting. Very, very sweet. Cream, peach and papaya. Oh, like hand cream, I guess. Wool socks. That's so cozy. We have games for family time. Let's say you have like a family game night or something like that in the winter because it's too cold outside. You could have um, a day or a week kind of decorated for family games. That's fun. Now we have the 4th, 4th of July, New Year's, New Year's celebration. Different colorway with the kind of lavender and the navy and the light blue. This is a fun sticker. Is this clear all the way through? Let's see. If it's clear all the way through, what you'll want to do is put a sticker. It is clear all the way through. So with this, you'd want to write underneath it, or even if you printed out a picture, you could print a picture and then put the sticker on top. So whatever you do, the sticker you'll want to put on top. Alternatively, you could use um, a pen like this one, which is an oil-based pen. This is the Unipen oil-based um, marker that you could write on top of the sticker. Very fun. Love the big disco ball. Then we get into Valentine's Day. So this definitely is encompassing all of winter. Lots of hearts and strawberries. Very cute. And now we have quotes for winter. Baking spirits bright. Let's stay home. Walking in a winter wonderland, do not open until December 25th. Snow much fun, snuggle up and, wa and watch it snow. Hot cocoa, a hug from the inside. It's snowing, snow is falling. When it snows, you have two choices, shovel or make snow angels. I love winter, put the magic in winter, never stop exploring. 
So lots of, these are all clear quotes. So the first two were kind of winter and snow related. Now we've got uh, a little bit more snow and winter, but we have forever and always, always be my forever. 365 days, 365 chances. Maybe that's for New Year's. Have a jolly holiday. Christmas magic is in the air. So a bunch of holiday themed quotes. This sticker book is the first we've seen, I think, from Amber Plants Her Day, where each sheet is its own sheet. So there aren't duplicate sheets in here. Though the snow melts, the memories last forever. Play to win, but enjoy the fun. So this would be a quote you'd use with that sheet with the games. Winter bucket list. This is fun. Go sledding, see a play, snowball fight, skiing, cookies, hot cocoa, holiday music, ice skating, pick a Christmas tree, go see Christmas lights. A good number of these are doable in Texas. A couple of them are not, like the snowball fight, unless it's winter 2020. If you're in Texas, you know, winter 2020. <laughs> these are great stickers. Or right, this is a great sticker book because, again, the difference between the winter collections and the winter memories is this is more for memory keeping. So you've got your bucket list, right? That's memory keeping related. And then you have all of these kind of headers for pictures. So remember, so much fun, documented, the best, write it down, snapshot, cherish, best day, sweet memory, loving this currently. These are all kind of prompts for photos or journaling. So I really like that these are included. And then hopefully you guys can tell there are some clear kind of sprinkles down the center for a little extra zhuzh. And then favorite part, today was perfect day. Today details captured, time well spent, happy day, so much happy on this day and the story. So again, headers for memory keeping. Love this sheet. We have lots of <coughs> excuse me lots of arrows so you could put a quote in and then arrow to a picture or a picture arrowed to a journal entry anything like that and yeah these are so much fun you could use these in your regular planner as well not just for memory keeping all of these you could use for your regular planner but very intentional um, you can tell she's been with memory keeping with this book then we have all kinds of fun banners. These are paper, so you can write on them. I love banners. They just, yeah, pull everything together so well. Then we get some journaling boxes. Now these look like they're sized for a big, I could be wrong, just given the width. Um, and most of, I think all of the memory keepers from, um, from the Happy Planner are in a big size. So these are probably sized for the big. You get two sheets of this layout. I tell a lie, you get three sheets, uh, four sheets, hold on, five sheets, six sheets, six sheets of memory keeping boxes for journal entries. So I could so easily see a spread coming together that's got a couple of these boxes. You've layered some pictures, maybe a banner for what happened that day, like snow trip, uh, and then your arrows pointing to the pictures, your little prompts here. Um, yeah, love it, love it, love it. So that is the Winter Memories book. She also has the Winter Collections book. I don't have that here to show you. So maybe check out Amber's um, YouTube channel, Amber Plans Her Day's YouTube channel to check out her Winter Collections book. And yeah, you can see the difference between the two and why you probably know. I love the memories book. So this is available now. Joyful 10 will save you 10% off of your purchase. Let's take a look at that new new from Jojo's Pretty Paper Shop. Uh, you guys know I'm a big fan. Um, she's also a friend. All of her items come in beautiful envelopes like this that can be used for other things. She doesn't stick them down. So I love, I always get my wedding envelope from Jojo and have a collection of those for when I send envelopes out to people. So um, you get a small um, uh, freebie card from Jojo. These have stickers on it, so make sure you hold on to that. And it gives you a little hint at the theme of her collection. And this is her winter collection. This is available now at Jojo's Pretty Paper Shop. She's a shop on Etsy. 
all of her stickers are hand illustrated. So she drew these herself and she has a most beautiful aesthetic. So here we have the um, winter and she went with greens and neutrals. I think these are so pretty, these sheets. So we've got the stockings, the presents, the fireplace, the chair. So here you can see how easy it would be to put together a whole scene in your planner. We have these kind of like block houses and trees and then her beautiful green florals. This collection is more in the blues. So we've got some greenery there. Uh, what is this design called? I'm gonna draw a blank, but um, I love the aesthetic of these as well. These three, actually these four, are clear matte stickers. I'm guessing this is a collection here, whereas this is a collection here. So she sells her sticker sheets as collections, but then you can, you can also pick them up individually. So love this aesthetic so much. Love the blues over here. This is the latest from JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop. Again, all hand illustrated and oh so lovely. And then JoJo sent me her 2023 calendar, which I was going to purchase this and... Um, she kind of surprised me around the time the baby was born, a package arrived and there was this cute onesie for Esther and, uh, she included the 2023 calendar. So this is available in her shop and there's a couple different ways you can purchase her calendar. Uh, you can purchase it just with this clip or she also includes, uh, the upgrade option of a stand, which I actually have a stand here that is not the one that she sells in her shop, but it's a similar aesthetic, I think. This, um, mine is actually broken, but see how this is just kind of like a like a bamboo stand for a phone. This is not, again, not what JoJo is selling, but she has a stand option where, hopefully you can see this all right, um, where you can actually stand up your, your calendar. So, um, she sent me the calendars with her rose gold clip and here you can see basically a sneaky peek of all of the different months of the year. Original hand-drawn floral illustrations used with a stand for a desktop calendar not included, a clip for a pin board or a magnetic clip for the fridge. So you can do any number of things with this. Um, I'm going to use this with the clip in my new office, you guys. My husband has been working hard on our office slash she shed. I really should call it an office at this point, but um, when that's done, we'll do a walkthrough of that so you, can, you guys can see how that turned out. But I'm excited to get my whole side of the office decked out and ready for filming and for planning. And this cutie patootie uh, calendar is definitely going to be up on display in my new office. So here is January. And again, she drew all of this, and this is on a nice card stock. So it's a thick card stock. And then we have February. So pretty. And it's just nice knowing, like, when I look around my office, I have things that have been hand designed by, by people. Do you know what I mean? It's just, it makes my space seem even more special. Here is March. April. May, so pretty, June, July, August, September. I like that the colors kind of go with the month. October, so we're getting warmer, right? November, even more warm and then December, so pretty. So that is the 2023 calendar from JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop. So if you have any any sort of like stand like this, the idea is that you would just kind of, I hope this, I don't think you can see this very well, but the idea is that it, you know, it's a calendar, so you would kind of like flip through it, right? Like so. So that is that new new from JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop. And then when you have a clip like this, you can just pin it on, you know, your wall and you would just flip through it like so. So that is everything. Let me see. I do have, 
Should I open my jet pens? Give you guys a little teaser. No, I'm not going to give you a teaser. I will show you though. I do have coming up. I ordered all of the white inked pens from jet pens. <laughs> I ordered all the white inked pens from jet pens, jet pens. So you don't have to. And my thought was I would do a pen test of white inked pens just to see which is the best. And I'm going to test them out on black paper, navy paper, um, craft paper, and we'll see how they do with writing out lines on Happy Planner pages. I always, always, always use the Uniball. It is my absolute favorite, but admittedly, there are white inked pens I have not tried before. So I will be coming out with a video soon, unboxing this guy and doing a white inked pen test. So um, if you want, oh, the other two things I was going to show you guys, this is kind of a collective haul, I guess. I did pick up two new clips from Oli Block or um, Oli Clip. This is a shop on Etsy and they're known for their magnetic clips. And they had a sale. I could not, basically whenever they have a sale that's at least 40% off, I go back to their, their shop and just see, is there anything I absolutely just wanna have just in case. And I've been dry, dying to try these ones. So this is the clip that is actually, they're, they're called Oli Dots. So there's two of them. And the idea, it, whoop, they are very strong magnets. Let me see if I have, hold on. Let me grab this guy. This is from Cloth and Paper. This is if you don't want to have like a clip up at the top, you would just do it like this. See that? So this has clipped this section together without it creating like a bookmark up at the top. I'm not sure for what reason I would use it, uh, but I just saw the sale and I like black clips and I liked the idea of having the magnets without the actual clipping at the top function. And so I went ahead and got these. So these are the dots, the Oli dots. Okay, and then um, many of you commented, let me pull this guy out. I think it's, I think it's on this one. Um, is it on this one? Yes. Okay, so here is my business planner. And I do have a setup of this, I think, on my channel, at least when I got my new um, Levenger snap clip uh, or snap. Um, leather cover but a lot of you asked about this this is an Oli Oli block clip and it's in matte black I really like their matte clips and they don't have a lot of matte ones a lot of them are like shiny plastic but when I went to their sale and I saw this one I could not resist so this is the Oli block in like a peacock color look at that so I had to get it I had to get it. So if you've noticed this in uh, any of my videos or like over on Instagram, this is an Ollie clip or an Ollie. I think the brand is Ollie Block and they call these clips Ollie clips. But I went ahead and I got one in this peacock color. It is stunning. So uh, I would strongly recommend these if you're looking for magnetic clips. They are so strong. But I will definitely point you towards the matte ones. I think the matte ones look a lot classier and cleaner. And they don't have that kind of plastic shine. So here is what the black looks like. And then here is, I think the color was peacock. I could be wrong, but um, I think it was peacock. So those were the two other uh, items that I picked up right before... Esther was born that I wanted to make sure that I showed you guys. So definitely watch uh, Ollie Block on Etsy around like Black Friday. I bet they're going to do 40, 50% off. So if you've been eyeing any of these magnetic clips, wait for a sale. Do not pay full price. So I will link their shop down below. I'm not an affiliate. I bought these on my own. Um, I'm just letting you guys know because I think, yeah, several of you asked about that clip. So that I think is everything for now. I know I've been all over the place. Thank you for bearing with me. We have the winter memories, memories from Amber Plans Her Day. We have the Black Quotes, Volume 2, 
These are linked down below and Joyful 10 will save you 10%. Then from Plan, plan Anything or Plan Anything, we have the Oofta. Let me grab my open one. The re-release of the Houses and Trees book, which my flip through is linked down below. And then the brand new All You Need Is Love sticker book. Beautiful, beautiful. Um, that is also linked down below. Affiliate links would love if you shopped with my, my link if you decide to pick, pick anything up. And then we have, of course, JoJo's Pretty Paper Shop. I'm not an affiliate of JoJo's. I'm just a fan and a friend. So if you decide to pick anything up from JoJo because of this video, just say, hey, Elizabeth says what's up. Saw it on her YouTube channel um, just so that she knows I said hello. So that is everything, friends. Oh, and then, of course, my clips. Uh, come hang out with me over on Instagram. My handle is ejjoyful underscore plans. It is always a good time. I am trying to get back into posting on Instagram and here on YouTube. But like I said at the beginning, I had a baby three weeks ago. So I'm still trying to figure out the ebbs and flows of life. So thank you for sticking with me, even though my content's gone down a little bit. I will be back. I miss you guys. I'm so glad that you're still here for me. And um, I can't wait till we do it again sometime. So until then, God bless you. God bless you and keep you do something creative today. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.